Hey guys, it's the TechnoTuber and today I would like to review and talk about the app which is called Real Racing 2 which is an incredible game which was before popular on the iOS platform and now it is brought to all of the Mac users. So for only $12.99 I didn't hesitate buying this game on the Mac App Store as I already knew it was good enough on the iOS. So I'm going to talk about the graphics, the details, the settings, the cars, pretty much everything which is included in this amazing game. Let's first start talking about the menu. So on the menu itself you basically have the career mode, quick race mode, um, the time trial where you can beat your own records by making races um, on the same track. You have the pit lane where you can customize your cars, upgrade them, buy and sell new cars and also see what your car settings are. You also have the multiplayer option where you can play against uh, different rivals on the internet or you can just play against your friends. Looking at the gameplay, let's just take a last look at the settings. The audio option is basically just moving the balance between the effects and the audio, I mean music. For the controls, I usually prefer playing with the arrows, but some people prefer playing with the S button to break. There is also a good feature, which is actually using your iOS device as a controller for controlling your game on your Mac. Well, I didn't actually manage to connect my iPhone to my Mac game, but um, correct me guys if you managed to do so in the comment section. Now let's look at the gameplay of the actual game. So once you start, you basically have this um, music, which I don't really like, uh, these horns, but, um, but some people may like it. The graphics of the game are just outstanding. I mean, every detail of the car, from the wheels to the roof, are just perfect. This is supposed to be like that in every single car game. Why isn't it so? I don't know. Besides from the Jaguar and another car, I'm not showing you a lot of cars in this review, but trust me, there are a lot of crazy cars in this game, such as this car, which is the Ford. When you crash against another car, it looks really realistic, like the drift and everything, and um, you can even break the bumper of the car or something like that, and it makes perfect noise, like the noise is really like compatible with the situation I would say. During the game while you're playing, you can actually go to the main menu and um, change all the settings you want except for the difficulty level. So unlike in many other games, this is possible in this game. So this game is pretty new on the Mac App Store and I really recommend you checking it out and I really think it's worth it because it's a really outstanding game. I mean the graphics and everything, the controls are, are just crazy. I, I haven't got much to say. For only $12.99 for a Mac game, I definitely recommend you checking it out. Leave down a comment how you like this game if you actually bought it and checked it out. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to check out my Christmas giveaway if you're not too far in the future while watching this video. I hope you guys have a nice day and I'll see you in my next videos. Peace.